Hey, welcome to Life Point. Uh, we are in week 10 of our Route 66 series, going through the book of James, and we're in chapter 4, and uh, verses 1 through 3. Before you open your Bible and start reading that passage, I've got a question for you, first of all. Uh, these won't be, this won't be a long talk, and it's not really a big question, but, but it will probably take you down a path of discussion in your Life Point that will take you some time. So I'm going to ask the question, pause the video, and then... Uh, and then we'll go from there. But um, I want you to talk about what it is that is uh, that you're in conflict with. What describe the conflict in your life right now? Some of you may not be in conflict, but some of you might be. And so um, uh, be careful that not you know not just one person spends the whole time talking. But explain what is it that that you're in conflict with. And what is causing conflict in your life? So pause it and then uh, come back. All right. So now I want you to read James chapter 4, verse 1 through 3 with me. If you got your Bibles, open up to it. It says, what causes fights and quarrels among you? Don't they come from your desires that battle within you? You desire, but you do not have, so you kill, you kill. You covet, but you cannot get what you want, so you quarrel and you fight. You don't have because you don't ask God. And when you ask, you don't ask. uh, When you ask, you don't receive because you ask with the wrong motives that you may spend what you get on your pleasures. So now, take some time and talk about really what are you in conflict with, with? What's causing the conflict in your life. There's a tendency for us to to want to point the finger at everything. It's our it's my boss, it's my husband, it's my wife, it's my kids, it's all this stuff. What's causing the conflict in your life? And can you take a moment and maybe just search your own heart and say, you know, what is it that's inside of me? What what are these desires that are battling within me? You know, uh, what kind of emotions are going on? What kind of expectations do I have? And and you know, how do I view life? I talked Sunday about um, there are two different paths you can take. One of, of just that uh, uh, feeling that everybody owes me something. It's an entitlement mentality. Or are you of the mindset that, you know what, everything, every day, every breath is a gift from God. And there's a gratitude and a gladness that comes out of that. And it makes a huge difference how you view life. Because if you think that everybody owes you something, and God included, then every time you don't get what you want, there's conflict. And so take a moment, talk about what really is causing conflict in your life. God bless you. Have a great week.